Oh, you guys, this is a cold day, a New Year's Day in Denver. Check out all the snow on the ground. I'm here at KFC to check out their new $3 spicy chicken famous bowl. Hello, welcome to KFC Main W. Take your time, let us know whenever you're ready. Hey, how's it going? I want to try the uh, new spicy famous bowl, please. It's not available like in a $5 box, is it? It or... actually is. Okay, thanks a lot, man. Thank you. Happy New Year's. Thank you. All right, you guys, I've got it. It's a snowy day here in Denver. The brand new spicy famous $3 chicken bowl. Except I got the $5 fill up. I'm going to find a spot. We're going to park it. I'm going to check it out. Welcome back, everybody, to an all-new Fast Food Pit Stops. I'm your host, Justin. Happy New Year. What a way to start out the year with something brand new from KFC. It just dropped today, you guys. Their all-new, spicy, $3 famous chicken bowl. Now, I had to ask at the drive-thru. This is actually available also in a $5 fill-up. KFC's always had bowls. They came out with the famous bowl just a few years ago it starts off with like their little popcorn chicken it's got mashed potatoes corn gravy cheese and it's all inside of a bowl as the name suggests kfc now has taken it one step further three years later and they've added their already existing nashville hot sauce supposedly drizzled on top to make this the new spicy famous three dollar bowl Oh man, it is a good looking bowl. It's a big bowl, which is never a bad thing. It's pretty hefty. It's probably maybe about a half pound. I'm assuming most of this is gonna be filled with potato. Enough talking, let's check it out. The new spicy, famous $3 bowl from KFC. Also available in a $5 fill up with a drink, a side, a biscuit. And I think there might be some cookies in here. Let's check it out. Oh yeah, man. Oh, I can smell the heat. I can smell Nashville. Take a look, man. So that is their popcorn chicken, which is delicious by itself if you haven't already had that. And they've obviously tossed it, it looks like, or coated it in that Nashville hot, that spicy sauce. You know, it's funny, I started the channel almost three years ago to the day and one of my first reviews, one of my most popular reviews is my Nashville hot chicken review. We've sort of now come full circle and KFC is offering this now in their very affordable $3 bowl. Let's go ahead and dip into it here. You can already see the cheese on top. Let's dip right into it and you can see peel back the layers, show off its nakedness. The beautiful mashed potatoes in there. I see little bits of corn, the cheese. Do you see the steam coming off this? It is hot, man. Oh yeah, and I can see just a little bit of that Nashville hot chicken oil. Right on top. And again, it looks like they have drizzled it a pretty good amount. You can see it all on that chicken <laughs> as I drop it into these creamy potatoes. Spicy and hot, like fresh right out of the microwave or oven or wherever they're preparing this new spicy $3 famous bowl. Do you see the oil, the Nashville hot oil down on the bottom there, right there? Oh man. I can't stand it anymore. Let's get some chicken, some corn, some potatoes, some cheese, some gravy. The spicy Nashville hot. A big bite. Cheers. Big bite! Mmm. Mmm. Can you hear the crunch? What's that? Oh, sorry. People next to me told me to turn down the crunch. A big bowl, a spicy bowl. You know, 
I always seem to be surprised at how spicy the Nashville hot chicken is. And I know a lot of you down in the comments are going to be like, it's not spicy, Justin. For a mainstream, pretty popular style of chicken, the Nashville hot, it is spicy for sure. Oh, I can just see all the red hot oil, which is exactly what they're pouring on here. The Nashville hot chicken is a hot oil based sauce. There's like chili powder in there, oil, and they drizzle it all on top of that chicken. Oh, wow. A good helping of chicken here. Remember by itself, this is $3. I don't know if you bought anything from KFC lately, but they're not exactly the cheapest chicken in the coop. Usually $3 might buy you like a couple pieces of chicken. In this, you're getting a pretty, I would say, hefty serving of this popcorn chicken. I'm seeing probably, I don't know, four, five, six, seven, eight pieces of chicken with the cheese just now starting to melt. Oh, look how beautiful, man. Come on. absolutely perfect on a day like today the snow outside it's the first of the month so you know rent's already due and your wallet might be kind of thin so this is the perfect recipe for success for filling that belly i cannot get over how good this is the spice level ugh, it's spicy enough it's making me hiccup a little bit but i think in the true spirit of the Denver winter. We need to make this bowl a little greener. Oh, Justin, there he goes again with the drug jokes. <laughs> We're not adding spinach Popeye, but we are gonna add some of these green beans and it looks like they're seasoned. I don't think I've ever had green beans from KFC. Ah, man, these are hot too, you see that? Little flakes of pepper in there, little specks of spicy death. Oh man, we are playing with fire right now. Get in there. Get in there. Man, this did not turn out the way I expected. Now this sort of looks a little more like a, a shepherd's pie. Woo. If you're used to that, well, it will in a second. Right now it just looks like a ton of green beans on top of this. I love shepherd's pie. I grew up, my mom used to make shepherd's pie, which of course traditionally you would use ground beef in, but it's basically this, potatoes, cheese, vegetables, meat of your choice. Let's do it, a big bite of this now much greener Denver spicy bowl from KFC. Big bite! <sighs> Man, you hear that? That is that chicken, that extra crispy popcorn chicken, man. And every one of those little kernels from the kernel are really caked in that Nashville hot spice. You can see it, it's red, it's spicy. It looked like it's gonna burn your mouth. Oh, each one of those captures and sort of sucks up some of that hot oil. So when you bite into it, it sort of explodes in your mouth. Mm. I'm not even like halfway through this bowl. It is a lot of food. I haven't even touched the drink. I haven't even touched the cookies or cookie. For $5, you guys, you get the cookie, the bowl, the drink, the side, the biscuit, it's God, KFC, you guys rock. Check it out, the KFC biscuit. Oh, God, it is buttery soft, and it's hot, too, man. Everything is nice and hot. This has been one of the better KFC meals. You know, you'd sort of think that the South would be proud and hold on to its cholesterol concave of states. But really, the KFCs in the South that I've experienced have been some of the worst. The KFCs out here in Denver are really good. You know, I think between the taste, the value, and the overall appeal of this meal, 
the $5 deal or just get it by itself. Three doll hairs. Whoa! The new spicy bowl is fantastic. And obviously, if you don't want the spicy chicken, get this in their regular bowl. It is just their regular popcorn chicken with the same accoutrement. I would imagine this is not going to be limited time. I would imagine you're going to be able to get the spicy bowl anytime you want because KFC has once again brought a taste of Nashville. And we amped it up with a little bit of green to make this beautiful Denver special super duper sticky icky bowl Woo! i think between the taste the value and the overall appeal of this meal for five bucks i think i would have to give this meal the whole deal probably about a nine and a half man it's up there it's a great deal it's a lot of food but not only is it a ton of food it's good tasting food. And if you have a good KFC around you like I do, then this is going to be a hell of a deal. A hell of a meal for the new spicy $3 famous bowl, man. God! Mm. But even though it wasn't a 10, man, it was so close. This thing was still a win, so I am going to go in on it here on a last bite. Big bite! Let's take this biscuit and stuff it. Come on. Absolutely beautiful. KFC, I love you. Some of this <laughs> Nashville hot popcorn chicken, the mashed potatoes, the corn, the green beans, the gravy, the cheese. Oh, man. On this buttery, soft biscuit. Have you ever seen anything that has looked so good? I highly doubt it. Let's do it. A last bite, big bite. As always, thanks again, everybody, for checking out another great review here on Fast Food Pit Stops. I'm your host, Justin. You know you love it. You came back for some more of it. I'll be back for another fast food review. Big bite. It's not spicy, Justin.